Good morning, Arthur. There, boy. Just be wandering around here, friend. for a moment. The name's William. Arthur. You familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Familiar ain't quite the word I'd use. Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants all across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all, to know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. But I'm only one man. Would you consider helping me with gathering herbs for my studies? Why? Knowledge, kindness, beauty. Well, I'm ignorant, ugly, and nasty. <laughs> well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. I'm looking for a plant called yarrow. You can distinguish it by its red flowers. It shouldn't be too hard to find. They thrive out in the open under direct sunlight.
now. with this hey shut it you always this intrusive ain't wise hey shut it damn fool see you in hell This one. Good work, Bart. You are a cruel, heartless woman. Dutch van der Lind, I am nothing of the kind. Then prove it. Good morning. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials, and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. Actually, you know, I'll these hides and furs either, can also okay? be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, Skill Tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Okay, I'll keep my eye out for him. How you feel? Stronger for sure. But not strong enough to work. Starting to look like home. It's taking shape. Good work, Miss Grimshaw. I'll go check on them in town. Please do. They've been gone a while. <laughs> 